Well, Second Lady Karen Pence visited the First Coast today. She made her focus military spouses and our veterans. On your side's Alex Ositis spent the afternoon with Pence and joins us live now from NES Jax. And Jeannie, the second lady will be headed out back to D.C. in just a little while, spending the afternoon touring the first coast and launching a training program here at NAS Jacks for military spouses. You're not by yourself. You're not all alone out there. We want to come alongside and help. Second lady Karen Pence traveling to the first coast Wednesday, launching the Teams program to help military spouses find employment and transition faster after moving, Pence explained his spouses are uprooted as part of serving our country. They may also struggle getting occupational credits in new states and finding something that she's hoping to fix. Laura Donson says for spouses who've moved a lot, she sees the program as a useful tool. I'm fortunate to not move a lot, but I have many friends who move every two or three years. And, and the more we can do to help them make that transition easy, the better. From NAS Jax, Pence traveled to Canines for Warriors. During the facilities, the second lady met with veterans, now leading efforts to train dogs and work with returning warriors like Crystal Fleming. Giving them another avenue to direct veterans to, I think will really, really help us um, extend our outreach to these veterans and be able to help more. Second Lady rounded out her tour of the First Coast at Social Grounds Coffee Shop in Springfield, where she discussed opportunities for returning military members as well as mental health. We'll have more on that coming up tonight on First Coast News at 6. Reporting live from NES Jacks, Alex Osiris, First Coast News on your side.